Yeah, man. So it all started with a tweet from 2K today, man, saying they just set themselves up for this one, man. And it just says it's National Grilled Cheese Day. What is your favorite type of cheese? And we're going to talk about all that good stuff, man, in one second. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment y'all thoughts down below. Let me know what your favorite type of cheese is down there, man, because, listen, we need the comments, we need the likes, we need all that stuff so we can go to the moon, Alice. And if nobody told y'all today, I'm rocking with you. You're my brother, you're my sister, you everything, y'all, everything to your boy. I love each and every last one of y'all, man. Now, let's get right into it. So, check it out. A lot of people they came with the you know they came with the conventional uh conventional answers a hey, pepper jack american american for sure but my boy yo boy never to be held up and never one to waste an opportunity down work he came with the left right cheese womp, 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 womp. <laughs> i am dead down work i ain't gonna lie to y'all man so check it out look a lot of people hey that's what they said bro i'm dead i'm dead <laughs> And then the 2K League said, I bet y'all won't say nothing either. Hey, it is what it is, man. We know that everybody's favorite type of cheese in this game is left, right cheese or what have you. And speaking of speaking of left, right cheese, man, continuing on down where he just says, hey, adrenaline was such a necessary addition. And so what we're going to do here, man, we're going to watch this little video of, of somebody. They, they was dribbling around and stuff. And so some people, you know, they, 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 didn't, they didn't like this. First off, I'm going to need y'all to stop recording off your cell phones and stuff when y'all doing this stuff man can y'all just just say the clips to xbox or the playstation and then just download them but anyway here we go so we got somebody in the backcourt dribbling 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 back and forth you see he flamed on all that good stuff just going back and forth back and forth back and forth now y'all can indirectly thank me for this but at the same time um i would and he green that joint man y'all can indirectly thank me for this man but at the same time uh, you know, it is what it is, man. Uh, I, I, it's my fault. Very, uh, a lot of it is my fault because I asked Mike to do that part because I was like, you know, you can really just press people in the backcourt. They would have no adrenaline to speak of by the time they cross half court, and thus, you know, they wouldn't be able to play offense or something like that. So, seeing something in the game that I could exploit, that I would have been able to exploit, I asked, I said, hey, man, can we change that? Because that's, that's not going to work well for everybody. So just, like, I just don't understand because people always be, be they, you know what I'm saying? They always come, Jay, 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 why, why you, you just want the game to be the way that you want? Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. I have never been one to want the game to be the way that I want it to be so that I could exploit something. Because as soon as I saw that, as soon as I heard that, I said, Mike, please make sure you, you know in the backcourt we don't want that to happen because i can turn somebody and make them use all three of those adrenalines in the backcourt they won't have nothing to do on offense anyway here we go it just says in the clip is in the clip in the in the clip it shows it does in the clip shown it doesn't uh it doesn't show the importance of it being necessary at that level once players begin to learn how to save adrenaline and master the cheesy concept at this level which is the park in the stage it won't matter how necessary it was uh that i, I got news for you uh, my, Quavius Young been doing that all year. Quavo Quavo was doing that from the beginning. Like he's like the first person I saw do that. Go back into the backcourt, and you have to respect him back there because he got a ninety some odd three ball. So you got to respect him back there. And he would he come across half court, do some, go into the backcourt, and he's gonna get a three up. It just is what it is. He's just that nice at the game. It is was what it was. And so and so he says, uh, downward came back and said, not sure what you're getting at. The only reason he's able to do this is because he's in the backcourt. Uh, they removed losing adrenaline in the backcourt to allow players to deal with full court presses. Like I said, y'all can halfway blame me for this. Sometimes when you ask for something, you have to ask for it exactly how you ask for it. I think it was just, I, I, it's good coding, but negligent on my part. I should have said when they go back into the backcourt, they got to be, they, you know, they shouldn't be half infinite in adrenaline. This doesn't matter in, in where we're playing right here in the wreck or whatever, because you can't go back into the backcourt. But in the part where you are permitted, to go back into the backcourt you know that's just something that, that we sh i should have thought about and i should have you know i should have mentioned yo make sure that we code it like that it's been like that all year and uh like i said very few people have abused it but uh at the stage yeah you're gonna see that and so he just says not sure why it's difficult to comprehend the message i hate when people say that like you're the smartest person in the world but hey it is what it is hey listen man even if you are the smartest person in the world we do not care
hey, like I said, we, it, just, it, just, it just is that simple. But it says, not sure uh, what why it's difficult for you to comprehend. Saying, saying once player, I'm saying once players uh, master the cheesy concept of staying in the backcourt, not losing adrenaline, it defeats the purpose of it being necessary. I get what he's trying to say, but like I said, you really late to the party. You really late to the game. Um, just, just on the simple fact that it's been going all all year. People been doing this all year. Um, ever since like re week one, since they figured out that, you know, that it was like that. And, uh, you know, so down work, he came back and he just said the point of adrenaline is to reduce cheesing, uh, is to reduce cheesing left, right in the half court. Left, right in the back court is rarely, uh, is rarely ever going to give, yield a significant advantage. Uh, what we saw was a troll and not a winning strategy. It actually is a winning strategy. I'm gonna disagree with you on that, but uh, we're gonna go in a second. Uh, no, no way does that clip provide <laughs> for proved that adrenaline uh, purpose is defeated. Now, I do agree with you on that. It in, in no way proves that the adrenaline, adrenaline purposes have been defeated, but at the very same time, it is effective and people can really score off of that, especially when you get out there and you play one of those six one-point guards or something like that. Bro, those dudes come out there and do that, it's really not a lot you can do. They're so fast that they, all they want to do is put some space between you and them. And when they put said space between you and them, then they're just going to sprint all the way out. And, uh, you know, they can they can get enough space and they can get their shots off. They can shoot from the backcourt, especially that guy, because he was flamed on. But, hey, it is what it is. And then uh, Air Samurai, that's my boy Sam. He says, LOL, troll, uh, a troll and an MF that can't play defense. Uh, why, is, why is he chasing him? Why is, hold up, why is, why he's chasing him Every time he makes the move, it's no idea, especially in the back, if he in the back, because he can shoot from there, Sam. I ain't going to lie to you. He can shoot from there. He flamed on. Um, they can damn near shoot from there if they not flamed on. Uh, in the backcourt, sit on one side of the body and force, and force that dummy to attack one side of the court. Now, nah, but see, if, if what y'all don't understand is, see, I, I think this is the part that a lot of people, is, that y'all are not getting, getting on this. If you don't chase him, uh, if you don't chase him on this, like, I can count all these shots. Bro, when you're right here, if he's a good, uh, y'all can't see, y'all can't see my uh, cursor. But when he's right here, if he continue to the right, he can shoot that. And even if, and even if this guy, uh, the guy that's in the middle of the court steps up, you know, he's passing that too. So like, I mean, all of this is really troll because the th I don't know where the third defender is or whatever like that. But I don't care who you think you are, you're not defending that, bro. Like it, it just is what it is. I get what y'all saying that it's that it's troll and stuff like that, but. Nah, I mean it's the it's some good players that do that stuff. They can't they can't um do it. But it in no way approves that adrenaline is 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 ineffective. In a, it is effective. They need to work on it and stuff like that. But you know it is what it is. He says hurting the offense by adding the unrealistic adrenaline bars doesn't help the doesn't help make the game uh doesn't help. It makes the game slow, and all it does is mask the fact that they didn't touch defense at all. I will give you that. I will definitely agree with that. And then last but not least, he says, but that's not realistic at all. Full court pressing is part of the game. Yeah, but you shouldn't lose adrenaline in the backcourt. Um, guards, guards should be able to learn how to beat a full court press. You can't beat it without without the, the way that you beat a full court. I don't know if you ever beat a full court press in real life, but when you're beating a full court press in real life, you actually pass the basketball. But the way that the game was when you're bringing it up, another way that you beat it is you attack angles. When I see an angle, I attack that angle and I'm gone. And if you step there too late, I run you over and it's a, and it's a defensive foul, but it's a blocking foul. But that's really how you beat it. But uh, he says, uh, <clears throat> but that's not realistic at all. We're in we're in season six of twenty season six two K twenty three. Uh, this isn't. This isn't rare at all. Bunch of players been doing it, not winning strategy, but didn't lose adrenaline. It actually is a winning strategy. I'm gonna tell you that right now because if the guy is actually decent, it's, it's a winning strategy, especially when he flamed on. He don't even gotta cross half court. I just seen Quav, Quav I'm telling you, I just seen Quavius Young go back into that back court and be flamed on. And when he is, he gonna go left, right, left, right. And then you know what he gonna say? You, I, I, when, he, when he do it, he gonna say, shut up. When you hear when you hear Quake, when you quit Quake Quavius Young say shut up, you know what time it is. He got him. Shut up. Shut up. Get off my court. Get the f up off my sh You hear him say that? You know what it is. So I get what y'all saying. It's not a winning strategy for a lot of people, but for the guys at a higher level, it definitely is a winning strategy. You can win all day uh with that. But 
Y'all gotta let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Is it cheese? Is it just cheese? Is it a winning strategy? Is it not? I'm telling you, Quavo, Quavo, and Bullet them. If you let them do that in the backcourt, they're killing you. Uh, elite shooter, all them guys. Anonymous gonna kill you. T Miz gonna kill you if you let him do that. Brooke can do it, but he just choose not to do it. And he know his guy can shoot from there. So I know a lot of guys can play, but like I said, I know, I know that um, you know, like we don't really play park anymore, and that's part of the reason. But the main reason, uh, you know, in rec, yeah, you're never gonna see that because you can't go into the backcourt. Anyway, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. I'm holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Champ. Guys, speak.